All right, so this is a bit of a different video here. So what's going on here is I have this container here, and pardon the poor video quality. I'm using my phone camera here, but as you can see in there, I have what I believe to be a giant host spider, they're called, assuming I have the right species. Um, he's inside this container here. Uh, he is wild caught, uh, but as you can see, he does have a nest slash web there. Um, I have fed it different things. I've f fed it things like earwigs, silverfish. Uh, I think I even fed it a yellow jacket, and it, it ate it just fine. So, you know, that's all good. Uh, moving on, there's the first thing. The second thing here, in this bowl here, we have a small superworm here. Um, now, the whole thing with this is I normally uh, buy these superworms because I have a pet bearded dragon. And naturally, that's what I mainly primarily feed to my bearded dragon is these superworms. I usually purchase them from PetSmart. Uh, with that being said, uh, these the ones I've been getting, including this one as of late, uh, are very, very small. Just as a comparison here, uh, here is my hand as opposed to the bowl. I could probably, yeah, I mean, my hand's about the same size as the inside of the bowl. And that's the size of the superworm. It's smaller than probably my pinky nail. Yeah, it is. So it is pretty small as opposed to the ones I normally feared, feed my bearded dragon in question. So here's my idea here. Because I have so many of these tiny ones that don't really do anything. Like, it's pretty hard to feed my bearded dragon with these. Um, I was going to try to feed one of these guys to the spider and see if it would eat it or not. So, let's try it. Alright, so in theory this shouldn't be too hard. I have the lid half open there and I have on the tweezers the super worm. So I'm going to try to put it in there. Alright, the worm is now inside of the container. Let's see if anything happens. Once again, I have never done this before, so this is the first time I've ever tried. Alright, so as of right now, the worm is currently just trying to dig a hole, and the spider is just sitting in the same spot. I kind of just gave him a helping hand there, but I dropped it right in front of him, and he seems to be trying to attack it. I believe that is a good sign. Let's see if I can... You can kind of see that now. Alright, yeah, he is indeed biting it. That being said, hopefully it'll be a good snack for him. If he indeed eats it and it's all good, that's cool. If not, well, that's okay. I mean, he is indeed a wild-caught spider. That being said, albeit this is a poor-quality video and all that, I'd like to say thank you for watching. And if you want to see other things like this, I got not just this guy. I don't know if it's strange or not. It's a bit of a hobby of mine where I collect different spiders and stuff that I can find locally where I live. So I do indeed have more than just this guy here. So if you'd like to see uh, anything similar to that, then feel free to comment and like this video. And ask and you shall receive. Anyways, thank you for watching and have a wonderful day. This is guy... Hopefully starts eating.